right in videoing at the moment so I don't know if the battery's going to go in a minute over there you've got Banwell Wood I think I stood here before last year I'm going to change cameras in a minute because this one's acting funny with the photos there's Banwell Hill Fort I'll sort of zoom in but I won't be able to see until I, later I get home but over there is Banwell Hill Fort, the top of the hill fort. Over there. Yeah, I'm going to use the other camera soon. I just like to use both. So there we go, look. And of course I've explored a lot of those woods, walked around them, walked up various lanes. Um, there's a lot of rooks about, a lot of cows mooing. There's a way up there, up to the, um, you know, up to the down, up there, Mender Pills. Just keep it running for a bit. I've just been experimenting with the gears a bit while I've had the chance. Um... But we'll be going downhill again now, so although I've had the video on, I'm going to have to turn it off again <laughs> to control the bike. Um, I've got a feeling there's supposed to be a lane in a minute, and maybe I passed it and didn't realise there's a possibility. This must be getting low on battery by now. It has a nice gentle breeze. Like I said, I've been practicing. I forgot about how to use gears. I haven't really. I usually. It's all a case of experimenting, really. There's lots of um, public bridle paths here. Well, there's a butterfly following me. Yeah, at the moment it's the wrong gear because I'm going downhill. <laughs> Going too far, I can't change gear when I got the camera. <laughs> I just let it potter down the hill on its own. <laughs> oh, I got the wrong gear, I know I have, but I don't care. Woo! That's the way up. I think the, the lane I'm on about is going to be... It's a lane that was sort of banned, not banned, but it was cut off for a while while they were Hinkley Point were digging their trenches for the cables, electric cables. Uh, they had it shut. Because that's sometimes that's a route I use. So I didn't want to do a big cycle now. And I felt like going back home now. I could uh, use that route. I think it'll be up here in a minute. Right, turn it off again. I think it's t just after this tree and this hedge, that's where the turning is, but it might still be closed. stop here for a second over there I'm not going to zoom in I'm not going to bother but over there's Banwell Castle and I do a walk up past the waterworks pick up a lake there's two different lanes you can use to go skirt Banwell Wood and then you can go back towards Hutton I'll be doing that this year
church is just coming into view. Oh yeah, here's the lane. Wait a minute. Looks like it must be open now, unless they've shut it further down. Max Mill Lane, yeah that's the way I would go if I was going to go to Croyston now. That would be a route I'd use. Right over there we've got the church. Don't know if it'll come in or not. As I said this camera's no good for zooming. Camping and caravan clubs like here. Yeah. Right folks, seems the camera's still working. Um, I've just just had a drink of water back there at Winscombe Station, the old station. Um, I'm gonna stop probably at the road at the cemetery to have a picnic and sort my bag out and change cameras then. This is a strawberry. This is the strawberry line. So I'll do a little bit of videoing going along here. Imagine the old steam trains that used to come and pick the strawberries up from Cheddar. Old Station Green it's called. Looks wider than usual but it's not. It's just because this is roughly the, the width of a railway gauge if you think about it. Um, so basically I'm going, skirting around Banwell, Banwell Hillfort, Banwell Wood. I've sort of been going round in a circle if you like. Um, I, I should be heading towards um, Sanford railway station which will probably be shut. That's where they often have old steam trains there or museum pieces. Uh, there might the, whether the cafe's open, I don't know. Um, I've brought all my own food. I can always top up the water at the cemetery. They've got water taps there. Um, which I'll put, that's probably what I'll do. quieter as kids are all back at school so it's quieter. I've chose a good day with the right wind as well. Five or six wind speed today. Now it's when I was going around this corner about ten years ago I first learnt about wobbly handlebars. Uh, they went wobbly just as I was going down here. People coming. Uh, cycle 26, right. People coming. I can never tell whether it's on or not. Yeah, I think it's back on now. It's very hard to tell. I can see the cemetery, so we're not far actually from the cemetery. This is the route I take when I'm going to walk through that Banwell oh, Wood and Hill for it. I go through the cemetery, there's a track at the bottom and you can follow it. But I think I will break here, have a break. And um, this is a place you can stop, of course, and have a break here. You usually get the seat to yourself. Um, I've done quite well actually, I've done better than I thought. <sighs> Definitely need a break though now. Through the cycle gate, 
my handlebar is just about to get through it. Here's an old uh, bridge going over the old railway line and that leads out onto the Sanford Road out there which I where you get the bus. If, I mean about a week ago I was over, or not even a week, I did uh, near Sanford Quarry I did over to uh, yeah, a couple of days ago. Yeah, a couple of days ago I've done that. There's the track if you want to go down to the wood down there. Look. And here's the um, the cemetery. I've just gone find somewhere to sit. Let me just get on. Alright, wait a minute. Oh, turn off. 